O when asked to lend a hand with the sun as the teacher, upon the scorched desert land was found a frail creature. Very urgently needing help, solemn and feeble the creature laid, it gave a shallow fainted yelp as it was rested in the shade. So was found a shady nest where the creature could now lay, there the creature now could rest, still surrounded in burning clay. Upon the morning's rising sun, with renewed strength and joy, all its frailties had been shun, and life it now could enjoy. Instead of staying low the tree, the creature set out fairly straight. In danger the creature would now be, anything now could be its fate. Along the way the creature found a lonely outback road, swiftly paced the creature bound, and then the creature slowed. The creature was well aware, its location it knew well. It had arrived at Lake Eyre, in joy the creature fell. Never will it be known why the creature strayed, or why the creature lived alone at Lake Eyre, the home it made. What kind of creature shall not be known, not ever known to you? Oh, I would live my life alone if I could live there too.